she's uh, staying here at the cemetery place alone. This is a stray girl that I'm feeding every day. Uh, I haven't paused about this girl a long time, but uh, I do feeding her every day. And this is the stray girl that uh, she always uh, frightened to the people and also she's uh, afraid of me too. Uh, I can't touch her since I feed her about two years. And she's living around this place and she's hiding in the cemetery place when I'm coming to feed her. Also, I feed my stray cats that living here too. And this is the place that I keep um, the food for uh, my stray cats. Today, I just coming and feed them. Also, uh, refill some more food like uh, rice and also biscuit. So I'm coming to feed her too because uh, she eats once a day. Also my stray cat, she eats once a day too. But um, my stray cat, I have food that um, I sell for them for uh, rice and also biscuit. And I also feed them when I uh, arrive there. So uh, my stray cat, they can eat all day. But for her, she eats only once a day. But the food that I uh, feed her is too much and then it can um, feed her for all days until the next tomorrow I go to feed her again um, this girl she's frightened yes when I uh, arrive and when I put the food in front she doesn't come but when I come a little bit far from her to feed my cat she's coming to eat are uh, you see she's coming to eat and uh, yeah, she's not uh, much frightened to me anymore, but uh, she doesn't let me touch. After eating, then she going back to uh, she going back to uh, the place that she's sleeping. She's still here, and I don't want to uh, make her frightened to me. So that's why I just uh, let her stay here, and I just bring food for her every day.